We're going to compare the Outdoor Research Astroman versus the REI Sierra Sun shirts. They both have their strengths and weaknesses, but there's definitely a clear favorite. You're looking at a sun shirt because probably you want some sun protection in that. It does work really well. We use it on our kayaks. We use it while we're hiking. It's the other ones that sometimes people don't think of. Yeah, I use it as a layer shirt. I have my, my t-shirt, this layer, another coat. When we're actually out hiking when it's a little bit colder and I just need that little extra layer. I wear these constantly. <laughs> yeah. And I wear them so much that I actually bought a secondary one. And I actually used it as my sleep shirt when we were backpacking Mount Rainier. And then also as a wind protection a little bit, especially with the hood when we were on the Oregon Coast Trail. Basically, when we're out hiking and outdoors, we pretty much never take them yeah. off. Let's get into the differences between these two shirts. The fit and style are very different between these. So this is the Outdoor Research <laughs> Astroman that we both have on right now. And as you can see, it's, a, it's, it's not super there. snug. It, it definitely is somewhat an athletic fit. It's not overly loose, but it's definitely, like you can see here, there's, there's extra room in there. There is. Which I actually really like, especially on super, super hot days. That's one of the big differences between this and the Ariana shirt. Yes. The, uh, well, let's put them on and show you the differences, what they look like. These are the REI Sahara Sun shirts. Yes. You can see right away, like if you look at my arms, like that, there's not a whole lot of extra room there. I don't have any, mine's pretty tight on my heart. And the, the center section is definitely snug. You'll also notice that it's very snug around the neck. Yeah. And then the hoods are also a little smaller. It's a comfortable shirt. It's just a lot tighter. It's definitely a lot tighter. And when it comes tighter, it ends up being slightly warmer. The difference for me though, is that the sleeve lengths are a lot longer because this is actually a medium where the outdoor research is a large. For me, these are both larges. They fit the same for me. Yeah. She just has crazy long arms. <laughs> so she had different yeah. sizes. Now let's go over the features of each of these shirts. We'll start with the REI Sahara. I think one of my favorite things about this shirt is the thumb holes. It does on both <laughs> the men and the women, which I was surprised yes. that the men's actually had it, which I actually really like because it definitely comes down farther over your hand, give you some hand protection. And actually these really help because I remember hiking one time and it was hot and you could actually see the line my this part of it was protected where my fingers were a little bit from gripping my trekking poles to get a little bit of sun but definitely helped protect my rest of my hand from the sun on their website they advertise as a three panel hood when you are dealing with this hood it's a pretty snug hood it's actually a very snug hood especially compared to the outdoor research mm -hmm. there's a interior string along the edge and there are no pull tabs. There are no pull tabs, but it, you can feel the string. So I think it kind of tightens it down. And if you are a hat wearer, on both of these, you can definitely wear a hat. This one's definitely going to be snugger, more snug. <laughs> if you are rock climbing and wearing a helmet, you're, this is going to go under your helmet. It, yeah. It's not going to fit over the top of your helmet. So Kelly looks kind of like a Sith Lord. <laughs> But here you can actually see, actually turn around. You can see the three panels. So there's that one panel right there and then the two side panels. It just, it makes it fit differently. Plus it actually looks like they give you a little yeah. extra room for, my, for your tail. ponytail. Yeah. The bottom hem on these shirts mm -hmm. is slightly different for the men's and women's. I'm the men's, obviously look, it's just a straight cut all the way around. And if you look at Kelly's, it actually has this little swoop to it. Yeah. And the back comes down halfway down the bum. And that way, her backpack is going to rest here and it's not going to constantly be, be pulling up. Enough. Yes. The other thing about these shirts is there are a lot of color options. There's actually quite a bit more than what the Apple Research has. Not only that, but you can find them pretty much at yes. every REI. Not so much the case for the Outdoor Research. Yeah. They're a little bit harder to find. And so if you're wanting to try them on, the Sahara is going to probably be much easier to do. If you're sensitive to things touching your neck like some people are, not saying who. Not me. <laughs> this one does not have a zipper and it's pretty snug up here. There's not a lot of ways for heat to escape on these. Yeah, but that might actually be a good thing for when it's a layer, maybe it's a little bit colder outside and you want this as your under layer. It could keep all that heat in as well. Transitioning to the Astroman. Man, so let's check out the features. They also have a three panel hood. So if we look at Kelly in here, 
you can see that this main panel comes up here and it's she does have a little extra room for her ponytail as well <laughs> i think that these hoods these are, are a little closer yes they these do. give you a little bit more sun protection yeah you look like the sith floor <laughs> And then also, when you have the hood on, you can zip all the way up and it snugs up underneath your neck a little bit and gives you a little bit of more protection on your neck. And then the zipper is protected by the little piece of fabric, so that zipper's not going to be rubbing up against your skin. Yeah. But I do really like how far they come on your face because you can see how much protection I'm getting versus the other one. Interesting enough, though, when I have this on, I actually have a little bit of a hard time hearing when um, we're out on the trail, so. For people wearing hats, you can see. Yeah, they, definitely. This stay works under. well here as well. And you can see how it, this protects out on the sides as well. And you could actually pull it down just a little bit more, give you like a really good side protection. I can actually see it in my peripherals. It's that yeah. far up. This quarter zipper is going to be one of the main differences you'll find between the Astro Man and the Sahara. Sahara has zero zippers. This one has this huge quarter zipper. Yeah, <laughs> and it's a little bit longer on the men's than it is on the women's. But why this is important is if you are wearing this, and say like the Sahara, you're, and it's 100 degrees out and heat is just building up inside, you can do this. You can just whoop, and then all that heat just poof, comes yes. right out. It actually works really, really well. It does, yes. It's one of the, our, the best features about it. The other unique thing is they have a zippered pocket. So the men's has it up on their chest. It's pretty, really big size. Yeah, the you can fit opening's your phone. not super huge, but if you look, it goes all the way up mm -hmm. to here. The bottom is down there. So it's, it's, it's covering this whole area. Yeah, and the women's is on the side. And it is a large as well. I mean, it's this whole area. So it's a it's a big pocket. I almost wish there was two pockets. So I could have one, because it seemed a little strange just to have one pocket. They also have the thumb thingy. It's a little bit, I think, I'm a little disappointing to me. Yeah, these thumb. don't have the typical slot where you stick your thumb. There's it's like a little elastic. There's in here, yeah, there's just this little elastic band. And it's a little bit hard to find sometimes. It is a little hard to find. And it's not like super comfortable. And it doesn't really protect your hand as much as the REIs. And this, I mean, like I said earlier, I had to get a large in this because of the, my arms. And I mean, this is right at the wrist and this is a large, so. But me, I have, I don't have horribly long arms. Not horribly, I don't have super long arms. You have a normal size. It arms. fits. Yeah. It fits me fine. Uh -huh. Yeah. Next up, we have the material. They're very different. But before well, we actually talk about the material, like what it's made of, the feel is the thing different. for me that mm -hmm. gets it. The Sahara, the REI one, it feels like your normal t-shirt. Yes, yes. It's a nice, it's a really nice soft fabric. It is extremely soft, very soft. Very soft. And then when it comes to the Astro Man, it's not as soft, but it's a lot of very it, lightweight compared very lightweight. to this. So it's actually just a little bit more see-through. Yeah, it almost feels um, very, it feels thin. It does. When it comes to being in the sun, <laughs> having that nice thin barrier yeah. feels a lot better. Yes, it does. The materials that are actually used to make these shirts, the REI is a polyester and spandex blend, where the outdoor research is actually a spandex and nylon, which makes it, I'm assuming, that's what makes it feel so lightweight is the nylon. The takeaways from the material on these is the Astro Man definitely is going to be cooler, that we found them to be much cooler. Mm -hmm. There is a time and a place where you want a slightly warmer sun shirt. Yes. If definitely. you're hiking in the winter and it's actually cold, <laughs> but you still don't want to get fried, the uh, Sahara actually does really well. And actually, we've been on some cold weather hikes where I left this at home and I did grab this. Yeah, but it really depends. <laughs> Another bonus feature is you could use this as a pillow because it is really soft. That's true. It is very soft. When it comes to weight, and that can be pretty important to some backpackers, the Outdoor Research one, the women's large is six ounces or 170 grams, where the REI medium, it's 7.3 ounces and 205 grams. So even though it's a smaller size shirt, it's actually a little bit heavier. And of course, I think that's because of the material itself. So it's over an ounce, 1.3 ounces heavier but it's polyester instead yeah. of the nylon, so. The men's, this one is 6.4 ounces or 180 grams. And the Sahara, the REI version, is 7.8 ounces or 220 grams. So it's- And they're both men's large. 1.4 
Mm -hmm. 1.4 ounces heavier. Yeah. So that's actually pretty significant. Especially when you're counting those ounces. If you're a grand weenie. <laughs> Which now let's get to the unfortunate part of the story. Yes. <laughs> price. Price. Um, there is a significant price difference between the both of them. Very significant yeah. price difference. Yeah. Double, basically. Yes. The REI is basically 50 bucks. The nice thing about REI stuff is, one, you always have a 20% off coupon yeah. several times a year, which you can use mm -hmm. and get that price down. But they will also put their REI-specific stuff on, on sale. sale. Yeah. Whereas the outdoor research currently it's at ninety nine dollars. Yeah, and honestly, the only reason we own this REI Sahara is I couldn't shell out a hundred bucks for a sun shirt, and so we tried this and worked well. And I did find one of these when these came on sale. I had to like, okay, we got to know, we got to at least try it. And once I put it on, I'm like, oh no, <laughs> we're gonna have to buy more of these. <laughs> Basically, I was wearing this every day, all day, <laughs> all the time. And it's like, I know I'm just going to wear this thing in the ground. And so I just put my watcher out and I grabbed this one. I think it was close to half off. Yeah. Even though it's literally double the price, mm -hmm. I think it is worth double the price compared yes. to that shirt. So I mean, they're both in a really nice shirt. They are. They both have their place. If sun is going to be your primary concern and the heat, mm -hmm. There is no comparison between the two shirts for me. I'm is out. it only because of the zipper you can open it in the field? Well, that, that's part of it, but okay. a big part of it is the material. Yeah, the nylon. Yeah, and the zipper, really. Is. <laughs> it's the zipper. <laughs> <laughs> Sun protection on these shirts can be slightly different. The REI ones are all 50 UPF. Yeah, both men and women, doesn't matter what color, 50. 50, whereas the outdoor research, they are actually 30, but their dark colors are UPF 50. To wrap this up, who is the winner? Well, we know which one you're going to choose. Yeah. Which one are we both wearing right yeah. now? <laughs> it's the Outdoor Research Astroman, hands down. It has more features than the Sahara. It's got better material. It has twice the cost. <laughs> yeah, it's not <laughs> twice. That's not really a good thing. I think the only thing that I really wish that it had is the better thumb hole, because I really like that on the REI shirt. Honestly, these are both really great shirts and we'll put links in the description below. Go check out this video next. You can find us at ExploreTrekAdventure.com and we'll see you next time.